on the first ever Amsu News Desk. The Bison men's hockey team goes for gold, the Ontario government increases post-secondary accessibility, and a taste test in University Center to see if students can tell the difference between bottled and tap water. I'm William Jordan. And I'm Carolina Osilka, and welcome to the Amsu News Desk. team are traveling to Alberta to meet the number one CIS ranked Alberta Golden Bears in a best of three series starting March 12th. The Manitoba Bisons have already qualified for the 2010 CIS tournament in Thunder Bay later this month, but they have yet to capture a Canada West title, losing both times in past opportunities. Manitoba finished their season this year in third place with Alberta ranked number one, but the two teams split their season series with two wins apiece. The Bisons are riding high with coach Mike Sarant being named the Canada West Men's Coach of the Year on Friday as well as goaltender Steve Christie being named to the conference all-star team. And in national school news, the government of Ontario introduced their throne speech last week and promised more graduates and plans to increase the amount of spots open for post-secondary education by over 20,000 students. While these announcements were made, there were no clear commitments to address the underfunding of Ontario's colleges and universities. The Canadian federal government also released their budget for the upcoming year, announcing their commitments to investing in areas of research and innovation. The Canadian Association of University Teachers have expressed disappointment, however, stating the amount of $32 million doesn't address the budget cuts from last year, nor provide additional support for the increased enrollment and debt loads of students. Manitoba's provincial budget is expected to be introduced on Tuesday, March 23rd. And finally, Bottled Water Free Day took place on campus on Thursday, March 11th, and students were offered a taste test to see if they could tell the difference between tap water on campus and bottled water. With more on that story, we turn to AMSU Vice President External, Alana Mackinson. Hey everyone, I'm Alana Mackinson, and I'm your Vice President External for the University of Manitoba Student Team. I'm down here in University Center right now on March 11th, Bottled Water Free Day, and I'm trying to see if people can really tell the difference between bottled water and tap water. Can you tell the difference? I sure can. Hey there, do you want to do a bottled water versus tap water taste test challenge? Did you want to take our taste test challenge? So we have either bottled water or tap water. Your choice, see if you can tell the difference. And then please tell me which one you prefer. This one has uh, an extra taste to it, almost chemically actually. Uh, slightly more of a mineral taste to the tap water, but okay. some people are like tap water, like no thank you, but I'll drink it, it's safe. Could you actually tell the difference between bottled water and tap water? I think this is tap and this is bottled. That is tap and that is bottled? Actually, this is bottled and this is tap. Ah, this is bottled water. Could you tell the difference between? Oh, yeah, I think. Well, I think. <laughs> for real, I know. Tap water. You are right. I would guess it's bottled water. It's bottled Even water? Even though I don't... This is tap water and you prefer tap water. So we're finally done. We've been here all afternoon. Uh, tons of people were here taking the bottled water versus tap water taste test challenge. We got great data and we're going to crunch the numbers and let you all know what the results are. Well that's all from us here at the Umsu News Desk. For a first show that wasn't too shabby. We did do good, didn't we? Spot on. And to anyone out there watching, Amsu would like to let you know that we would love to have your involvement here at Amsu Vision. If you have any ideas or talent or both, we would love to hear from you. So stop by at the Amsu office or email us at the address below. Uh, Amsu is your student union, so get involved. Once again, I'm Carolina Basilica. And I'm William Jordan. We'll see you next week.